Hey YouTube, it's Jonesy77 and I am coming through today to say Happy Thanksgiving, Happy Black Friday, and Happy Saturday. Um, today is Saturday and um, it is um, one day after Black Friday and two days after Thanksgiving. And um, while I didn't get up at 4 a.m. to fight through the early Black Friday crowds, I did get out and I got a lot of shopping done. Um, I went to Forever 21, I went to a fragrance store, and I also went to AJ Wright and the Rainbow Shop. So I picked up a lot of stuff. Um, I picked up stuff for myself, I picked up stuff for my children. Um, so you can stay tuned for at least three to four separate hauls, which are going to be showing you guys lots and lots of bargains, um, some of which should still be on sale because they were not specific to Black Friday. They were just things that I was out shopping for. I just wanted to be out there in the midst of all the madness on yesterday. So. Um, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to go through the four fragrances that I picked up um, on yesterday. Um, three of them I did pick up um, at AJ Wright and the last fragrance I picked up um, at the fragrance store that I went to. So here we go. Um, the first fragrance that I picked up, now I'm going to show you guys the box. Now this is a 1.7 fluid ounce um, box or bottle I should say. Um, and this is Forever Elizabeth by Elizabeth Taylor. Um, this fragrance, I believe, was introduced in 2002. I'm going to show you what the bottle looks like since I've already opened it. Um, here's the bottle. And um, this fragrance was $9.99 um, in AJ Wright. Um, if I can just give you a little bit of information about the fragrance, what I will say is that it's a slightly uh, more mature fragrance. So um, I'm 32 years old, so I think that it's it's appropriate for me. Um, not so much to go out, let's say, to a nightclub, but maybe during the day. It's more like of a uh, like a casual fragrance. It has uh, jasmine. Um, let's see, let's see if I can smell this up and and give you guys. Hmm maybe a little amber um, but it's a cool fragrance just a little bit more mature so I don't think that my little young girls out there are going to like this but um, for those mature uh, ladies out there give it a try nice casual fragrance something that you can wear into the office or maybe um, out to dinner um, forever Elizabeth okay so the next fragrance now I didn't actually open this fragrance this is um, also by Elizabeth Taylor I love Elizabeth Taylor's fragrances um, this is black pearls and this is how it's packaged now black pearls was introduced in 1996 um, and this is also a mature fragrance, but it's a perfume. Now, because this is one of my all-time favorite fragrances, it's not open, but I do have a bottle of it somewhere. It's here. Let me set that down. Um, and it's damn near empty because I wear this a lot, but it's a perfume, which means it goes on and it, it stays on all day. Um, it's, a, it's a woodsy fragrance, so um, it's a really nice um, fall-winter fragrance to wear. Um, it smells really, really good, and um, you'll get many compliments on this. So this is Black Pearls. This is what the bottle looks like. Um, this is how it's packaged. Um, this was also $9.99 at AJ Wright. Okay, the third fragrance that I picked up at um, AJ Wright, it was also $9.99. Um, this is a summery fragrance, but it's okay because us fashionistas don't play by the rules when it comes to anything that we do. So um, no excuse to save this particular fragrance for the summer. Um, this is Nautica Blue. Um, I'm sorry, this is Nautica Bermuda Blue for women. Um, this fragrance, again, was also $9.99. Um, when I smelled this fragrance, it made me feel like I was on the beach somewhere, like on an island or even in Florida. Um, this is what the bottle looks like. Now, this is a one fluid ounce bottle, so it's not that big. So if you just wanted to try it out or if you wanted to get someone a nice Christmas grab bag gift, don't be reluctant that, you know, because it's a summer fragrance that you don't want to pick it up and, and give it to them because it's non-traditional. Uh, it, really, it really, really, really smells cool. cool. It really kind of reminds me of the cool water arena type fragrance. Um, it's a really, 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 really good, good fragrance. I think I'm actually going to wear this today. Um, it smells so good. So if you're out and about, you have an AJ right in your area, um, please, please cop this. Um, my young girls would actually love this. So that's um, Demuta Blue by Nautica. And lastly, but certainly, 
not least. Um, this particular fragrance I didn't get from AJ Wright. I got this from um, a perfume store um, in Newport Center Mall in Jersey City. Um, this fragrance is called Realities, and I'm not really sure who this is by. I'll, I'll see if I can. Who is this by? Um, it looks like it's it's distributed by Realities Cosmetics. Um, so. It doesn't really say that it's by anyone in particular, um, but I stumbled upon this particular fragrance in um, the ladies' room at my job. I had gone into um, a bathroom on one of the random floors, and they had um, designer fragrance lotions um, on the bathroom uh, sink. And um, after I washed my hands, I picked this, uh, this bottle, the tube of lotion, I should say, up and tried it on and it smelled so so good so um, this bottle is a 3.4 fluid ounce bottle so it's really really big um, this will last a very long time this is a discontinued fragrance so I'm glad I was actually able to cop this um, I paid $45 for it and it's a perfume and actually all three fragrances or all four fragrances I showed you um, our perfume uh, sprays, so they're actually going to stay on for you. Um, you don't have to keep reapplying it or refreshing it. Um, and with this particular fragrance, I'm not sure when this was introduced to us, but I do know that they no longer sell it. Um, it's also like a woodsy fragrance, something that you can definitely rock in the fall and winter, but don't be reluctant. You could also wear it in the in the spring and summer. I do not um, limit myself when it comes to my fragrances. It all goes based on how I'm feeling. Um, so that is my fragrance haul. I hope you guys have found this help, um, helpful. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, anything under the sun, please feel free to either comment below or you can email me at jonesy77 at yahoo.com. Um, again, I have additional hauls coming up, so stay tuned. As always, be blessed, and I love you. Thank you.